All right, here we go. Another beautiful day in paradise. What's up, Sammy? I want coffee. Coffee before claims? We got this big dog package going out. It's a computer. I packaged it perfectly. It's a computer, what are they, a tower. Mm -hmm. And it weighs about 30 pounds. Like 40. So, shipping this, so shipping another item. More for shipping than they paid for the item. Yeah, for sure. Sissy wants to say hi. And then, say good morning, Sissy. Come on, princess. Show everybody what you got, girl. CZ. Come on, show them what you got, sis. She's like... She's over your shit. All right, first off, look at Sammy's outfit for tomorrow's shoot. If it goes down tomorrow or next week. This thing smells like roadkill, but it looks like heaven. <laughs> Wait, come back. Come back. Sis. Sissy! She's like getting death in here. Alright, so here's these pool balls someone bought. I fit them in the priority box. Smart call. But they just look so cool all together in here. Wow. And this is like two sets. Can you unblock me? There's two threes right there. Alright, so I'm actually just going to try and make this for my brother's birthday, which is today. For a present. So... We have a fire extinguisher, and I'm about to paint it from the neck down, orange. I'm going to be painting this black and putting a logo on it, and then I'm going to be making a tag um, from a pharmacy. So I'm going to be making a pill bottle spoof propaganda consume uh, opioid epidemic type play on government issued heroin which is what I consider the epidemic in our country pharmaceutical companies pushing drugs on kids pushing drugs on people that get injured um, they get addicted to painkillers they get addicted to opioids and they end up on heroin so Huge epidemic uh, worldwide, nationwide, and I think it's important to make powerful pieces of art that portray the way I see the world. So, my brother loves my art, and it's his birthday today. So I'm gonna get him, make him something that I think he will enjoy, and something that's unique and special. So this is how we're starting out. I'm actually gonna Windex. Well, if this works. Try to Windex this and just wipe it down with a rag. All right, change of plans. The orange paint that I thought I was gonna use, shot. Look at that. Get a lot of the paint that I use from foreclosure, so it's always a gamble. And you never know if it's actually gonna even be good until you open it. Well, you can get a sense that it's not, but when you're, either way, I'm about to dip this. All right, change of plans once again. This is how the art works though. We're gonna go get some paint from the store, make orange paint and do another layer over the pink. So hopefully the pink drips come down through and gonna go to the grocery store too. But want it to be orange, we realized, I realized, Sammy said it should be too, so. All right, we're looking for this paint, but not oil-based. So, I'm gonna get it mixed, I guess. So, what's the... Okay, we got this paint. And it was $17, so I definitely advise anyone that works on jobs where they can get free paint, do it. Because I had a whole gallon of orange paint, well, probably like a quarter of a gallon, but it was dried out. But I was like, yeah, free paint, cha-ching and didn't happen, but we're going in the grocery store now. What's the list looking like? Yo, you want me to read it? Yeah. Water, yogurt, tuna, cheese, eggs, 
tampons, mouthwash, milk, kale, blueberries, bananas. And then I was just gonna, you know, freehand it from there. I mean, sometimes you just gotta splurge and get that alkaline water, though. That rich people stuff. Politician water. Once a month, just George Bush yourself. drinks alkaline water. With this water. Alright, so I'm gonna use a hair dryer to dry this thing off. So we can get the next layer of paint on here. Just plopped a little piece of computer paper in here. Let's see what we're doing. Get a little bit in the middle there. All this. Mm -hmm. Sissy. And MJ went to fetch some snacks from the pantry. <laughs> Are you going to continue the storyline? Yes. <laughs> Don't go back. Keep going. Oh, are you to the end? So what do you do? Uh, move the paper over. How do you do that? Hold on. You can continue the storyline. I'll put... When they got to the... Keep going. Standing. Oh. I enjoy. Standing. Thing. Period. Space. Their father. <laughs> Isn't it fun to use a typewriter right now? <laughs> like you might have to just get more ink for this and just use it. All the snacks? Question mark? Gone. Daddy ate all the snacks. Period. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty good story. <laughs> ah. Sissy and MJ went to fetch some snacks from the pantry. When they got to the pantry, who other than their father was standing there? Their father. And where were all the snacks? Question mark. Gone. No snacks for sissy Go on. and MJ. Period. <laughs> Period. Feels good to be alive, doesn't it? Sammy J. All right, so here we go. We got an offer up. Buyer coming to pick this up. We're meeting them at Rite Aid. So this is a wet saw. Um, not really sure why it's upside down in here. Got this from Concrete Rob, the boy. I'm gonna have to turn it this way though. I think I put it upside down though. Right here, boys. Woo! Wet saw life. So here's this piece. Here's the blade. Probably need a new one. And 
the other pieces that go with it. So 30 bucks. I had it up for 40. The guy wanted me to deliver it to Pleasantville. I said, come pick it up, I'll do it for 30. I'm not really sure the retail price of this, but it was given to me by a friend for free. And I'm figuring 30 bucks is 30 bucks. So that's the claim. All right, so we're doing a premiere right now. Just started it, gave it a few minutes, 10 minutes for people to get into it. So we got people, one guy chatting already on there. I think it's a guy, cops, huh? Okay, we're going for it. So we're gonna start doing these more often. And then Sammy's gonna say show some items for sale after this. Mm -hmm. So that's the claim. But these are pretty cool. Couple people on here. So cop son said, love your guys vids, legit come home just waiting for them to drop every night. So that's just so crazy and amazing to hear from people. Very you look nice. pretty tonight. Thanks. You do something a little extra today or something? You Maybe. looking like a sissy and shit. Sissy! Oh, right. Lay him out. One. This one was on the other video, right? Yeah, so we don't need to do that. Thanks, so much. Uh, we're gonna do a little bit more expensive. Was this on it? No. no. This is a cool hat, though. I'm not gonna lie. What is this? A hat? Uh, that's Keepwife. Keepwife? Mm -hmm. Is this? I might just keep this, I don't know. Alright, so, go ahead. Give him your pitch, MJ. Give him your pitch, Bubba. Alright, he's being shy because he's just a baby puppy pup. So what's going on here? He's loving his mama. Give me that eye boogie. Go on with yourself. Let me do what I'm doing. Come on. He wants to do it too. Yeah, so what are you that. doing? <laughs> He's rubbing the camera. That's really sweet. Now you're taking the attention off of mama. Okay, so these are some items that we're gonna have for sale. Don't mind my son, he's very rude. Get your nose out of there, stink. All right, I'll do the ones that I know. So, this hat, it's cute, it's a gray hat. It's got the little ears on it. I'm gonna say, five bucks for this plus whatever the shipping is so that's that this New York hat should I be trying these on you don't need to no right it's not even a, a girl's hat is it I don't know it could be unisex I guess it's a this is a unisex hat for sure so this is a New York hat I thought it was cool kind of reminded me of like thing one thing two this is ten just because it's cool as... All right. I can show them pretty easily. Yeah. Um, so that's 10 plus shipping. Um, this hat, this is a Patagonia hat. I'm going to go with 30 for this just because it is really cool. Totally vintage. I don't know what they consider that. I this don't. is a six panel hat, yeah. even though it looks like a five panel. It does, it did, that's Oh, it I is five that. panels, but not really. Not really. Because look though, one, two, three, four, five, but it's cut in half, it's supposed to have it's six. It's cut in half and it doesn't really look like a five panel hat. Either way, Patagonia, like, totally cooler than a five panel maybe hat. not really that easy to find. So if you like the design. With the fishies? I don't know. But so thirty plus. I shipping. think I paid like 
but pretty much a pretty good amount for it anyway. Pretty good amount. Um, this is an Ugg hat. I keep forgetting I have this thing on my head so I can't really try them on for you. But it goes this way. It can go anyway, really, right? right? The tag's in the back. Oh, I guess it doesn't matter. You could just I don't cut know. This the is tag yours. Out. How much would you say for that? I'd say 25. It says small. Or OS. I don't know. It's small, but it fits your head, right? Or is it too small for you? Yeah, say. Here. I wouldn't say this is necessarily mine. I would wear this, though. Wait, why is it? It's not focusing because the light. At all. Should focus more. Alright, here's the Og hat. So, 25 plus shipping. Negotiable, too. So. But that's a cool hat. I don't even know if you can get that very often. I'll show this one. Alright. So this is a NBA 2008 Denver Nuggets <laughs> cape, which I don't think is ripped or anything. It's kind of like, like, guess like frat boyish slash like if you're just a heavy Denver Nuggets fan. But we don't live in Denver. I'd say 12 bucks for this. Plus shipping. Yeah, which shipping on this would probably be 350 if that. Yeah, because it's really light. 15 15 with shipping. Okay. Cool. So those are the items. And then the last. All right, are you ready to talk about these mucklucks? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Or no? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You are, at this moment, standing in your own acres of diamonds. You know why? Because MJ just poops diamonds out of his butt. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> Look at him. Come on, MJ. Move my baby. Get my baby in. Get my baby. <laughs> Look at these snack cabinets we got here. Get my baby. Doritos. Italian bread. Give me all my MJ. This is the beans you gotta get. Give me all Folgers yeah. Coffee. Yeah. Club Originals. Who remembers these? Yeah, Win movie tickets. Wow. Oh, I love him so much I could just eat his face off. Alright, come on. Let's get these Snack Factory. Should we get these popping? Alright, so these. Woo, these are nice as hell. I loved them so much because they were in like literally new condition. They had a sticker on the bottom, so that's what that looks like. But like, you, you can see in the this light. Way. Really good condition. Um, they're a size nine. I'm a size five to six, depending on what the brand is. But I can wear these and get away with it because the fur like covers it, so you don't really see how big. You know what I mean? The actual shoe is, but. They are size 9, so they are too big for me. Um, and they've just been sitting in the closet. So, I'm asking 65 for them. Um, there's places online that I think sell them for like 75 whatever. And that's lower than they usually are, because I think they were selling them at like Kohl's or something for 100 So, I think 65 Plus the shipping is a good deal. Um, so if you want them, just email us. T-F-U-N-U-V at gmail dot com. So yeah, these are really cute. Like, you want really to show cute. us M uh, the back cats? Yeah, I'll take you back here. Show you this little stash I got going back here. They're homegrown. They're not homegrown. <laughs> <laughs> no, they're they're not. brats and they have a heater. Oh, it's not even on. Yeah, they're my fat boy. I know. I'm so we got this heater from Leland. Even Leland. though they have heat in here, I spoil them. It's and not put this on. hot in here like yeah, you think. Yeah, because it's not hot in here because of this freaking door. Their cat door, like, lets all the air in. So. Landis loves, loves, loves the heater, though. Mm -hmm. Like, we just it's get this closer to that fatty. Lucky girl's not down with that heater though, because it makes this weird like clicking sound, so she gets bugged out over it. Like, Lucky. I she gets wanna... bugged out over a pin dropping on the floor. Let's be real. Yeah, she crazy. Eat when we come in here. What do you mean? 
all the time actually but but we have shelves and shelves of items still in here for sale yeah so these well, are that our guard cookie cats. jar is not for sale but just keep life right lucky you guard all of our all goodies of these things we got to do a better view of this stuff but two shelves shelf shelf just crazy amounts of stuff so if anyone's looking to get anything in here 131 how, Wait, how much do i weigh 184. Same weight I've been since I was like 18. Nice. Alright, so we're out of here for the night. Uh, I think the claim is just keep pushing everyone. The dream is so real. So. And good night or good morning. You! You!